When U.S. soldiers are injured in the line of duty, they can count on some of the best medical care in the world. The U.S. Army wants military dogs to receive that same standard of care, and a new partnership with veterinary leaders is helping with that mission. Bradley Blackburn explains. Military working dogs serve on front lines around the globe, and now U.S. Army veterinarians are training on the front lines at home, embedding in Blue Pearl veterinary emergency rooms. They spend three weeks rotating with our emergency doctors, our specialists, really to get their their hands on these cases, do some of the procedures that they may have to do when they're abroad. The partnership, which comes at no cost to the Army, gives military veterinarians 70 hours of online training and then real-world experience treating pet trauma before encountering it on a battlefield. In a combat scenario, the risks are that they would be a gunshot wound or there would be a uh, in the proximity of an, of an explosive device. Colonel and, Deborah uh, Whitmer says system. some 1,700 dogs are working across the military. Their roles are essential and they're valuable, highly trained assets. They're what we call a force multiplier. They also create tight bonds with their human partners. Rarely do you see a soldier cry, but I have seen them shed tears and, and get emotional when talking about their canine partners. Absolutely. And it oftentimes is the strongest, biggest, toughest individual who has that intensely emotional connection. A new way to help all warriors get the best care, even those serving on four legs. Bradley Blackburn, CBS News.